I'm Phil Pops Porter and we are the Fort Mackinac Never Sweats, the baseball team that's based on the historic baseball team that the soldiers had here at Fort Mackinac in the 1880s. And right now we're practicing getting ready for our big game on July 21st against the Mackinac City Boys. The fascinating thing is that the soldiers at Fort Mackinac actually played a team from Mackinac City way back in 1886, so we're kind of recreating that exciting event. The way we play baseball is according to the 1860s rules, where they're a little bit different than baseball today, but it's the origin of, of the game we play today at the same time. So you'll watch, Kenny here is about to hit one to the outfield, and what you'll see him do is hit a ball, and the guy's going to catch it on one bounce, and that is still an out, which is a little bit different than today. The difference is a runner can be moving, they don't have to tag when it's one bounce. If he catches it in the air, same as today, you have to take uh, a tag on the base before you can run. A few of the other differences are, you'll see none of the guys out there have mitts. That's a big difference and it makes it a much more challenging game. There's our shortstop, Craig Wagonburner Bunker. He's really good down in the hot spot. And uh, what was just hit to him was a ground ball and back then they called them daisy cutters. Some of the other terms are the uh, fans are known as the cranks, the pitcher's known as the hurler, the catcher's known as the behind, uh, outs are called a one man or one ace dead, and um, a few other terms like that. We're going to have a lot of fun playing this game, and as people come, they'll learn about the history as at the same time they'll be able to watch their hometown team of the Fort Mackinac Never Sweats play the game.